Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to connect Canva to N8N so that you can fill your Canva brand templates automatically. You can put in text, uh, video, um, images. So, but first you got to connect to N8N and it's not the easiest thing in the world. So I'm going to walk you through step by step. So I'm here in a blank um, N8N workflow. So let's uh, add in an HTTP request. Then what we're going to do is go into authentication, generic, and then OAuth to API. And then I'm going to create a new one. I'm going to call it Canva Demo 2. And then leave this open because we're going to have to come back here and grab the, oh, uh, the, um, the OAuth redirect and then fill in the rest of this information. I have also a, uh, a doc here. Uh, I'll link to this in the description so that you can copy and paste this information. Uh, so first thing we're going to do is go to canva.dev. Once you're at canva.dev, go to your integrations and then create a new one. It's going to be public, agree, and then create integration. And then just give it a name. So let's call this N8N Connection Demo. Okay, that's the max. Um, we're going to come back to this, but first we're going to go over to scopes. And then we're basically just going to select all of the available boxes here. Uh, this might not be best practice for security, but I think we pretty much need access to most of this um, to do what we want to do. So we're going to select all of these. Then we're going to go to authentication. And then this is where we're going to paste that link from N8N. So go back to N8N, copy this link, OAuth redirect URL, put that in here. All right, then we need to go back to configuration and we're going to copy this client ID, go back to N8N, put that in client ID, and then go back to Canva, click Generate Secret. We're going to have to copy this. And we're going to put that here in Client Secret. Now, these other fields I put for you here in this Google Doc. So for the authorization URL, we're going to take this, put that here. For grant type, you need to change this from authorization code to PKCE. Access token URL, I have here for you. And then the scopes, you gotta, basically all the scopes that we authorized earlier, you kinda gotta type them out. So I've just done that for you already. Just copy, paste. Um, the auth URI query parameters we have right here, response type equals, equals code. Put that here. Authentication type is body. And that should be everything. Then you click connect my account. Takes you to the Canva authentication screen. Click allow. And then you're connected. Simple as that. Then what you can do is you can upload assets. So if you want to fill in images in uh, Canva template, you upload the asset. Um, and then you can also use another uh, endpoint to autofill that template. And then you can download those templates and post them to social media. So those will be in future videos. But for now, get your uh, Canva uh, connected. And then we'll show you how to do the uploads and the autofills. All right. Thanks for watching.